All right, guys, we're out again. St. Cloud Canal, Canal C31, Florida Expressway behind me. We're actually going this way, about half a mile up to State Road 192. It's a main road, it's a bridge. That's where we were last time we were magnet fishing. We ended up pulling up a, um, four bicycles couple of other things so we'll get in there we'll see what we can find today we got a new mount for the canoe we got a life jacket in there we got a new that I can show you got us a new camera mount we built we're gonna test that out today and for magnet we've got our Artemis 360 from Kratos Magnetics. If you're wanting a magnet, you want to see if you can find what I find, go to Kratos Magnetics. Order yourself an Artemis. Great magnet, great all around magnet. Not too big, only weighs about two and a half pounds. We'll pull up just about anything you find. We'll see you on the water. I did see right on the other side of the dock, it looked like there was a big bucket, which I want that. We'll grab that. Oh, this water's warm. That's not too warm. Just want to splash it up. See that bucket right ahead of me. Just sitting out of the water. Kind of slow her up a little bit. Also, well, that's not a bucket. Hey guys, so we got for first find. We got us a big pan. Sweet. We'll definitely take that get that out of the water. Can't complain on that one little bit. Nice peaceful paddle here, guys. Just paddle along. I had to throw a headband on and keep the sweat out of my eyes. It's awfully dried out today. St. Cloud and Osceola County. Up in the distance, another probably quarter mile, we've got the spillway between Lake Coho Picalaga and East Lake Coho Picalaga. You can already see we got stuff up on the shore again. There does, I believe, the family living under here. So explain some of the garbage in the shore. It's a sad thing when people have to live under a bridge. Kind of like trolls. This is the troll bridge. Thank you. 
have a shopping cart there, mostly out of the water. See another one up higher. I don't really like those down here. But there's not a lot I can do about them. Can't put them all in the canoe. So, kind of drift in a minute. Get myself in the shade and get things situated. Alright guys, we are up and under the bridge. I've already threw them a couple of times, but I'm just getting situated back in the right section of the canoe here. A lot of garbage in here. Oh, big fish just got. Get us back in the water. I'm kind of up on the rocks. This area is kind of rough. Not my favorite spot. have a couple of things before we get out of the water though. started and I've already got a full load in here guys what's that tell you it tells me there's a lot of junk in this canal Mark just say it's all trash what do you got there it's like a windshield wiper blade nails So I was just chatting with the ride coordinator for Marsh Landing Airboats tours here. She said that there were, there's probably four cell phones down here just off the dock. Their boat captains have lost them. So I'm gonna check and see if I can't find them. 
We got an airboat coming in, so I'm gonna show you. Here we go. It's a Marsh Landing airboat coming in. They're coming on in to visit. The two are just getting over. Good times. Yeah. Spring caliper inside. 